In today's video, we are going to explore web scrapping using Node-RED and how we can display the scrapped, scrapped data on HTML page. Web scrapping allows us to extract information from website, process it programmatically. So let's dive in. So here is the Node-RED flow we will be working with. We have a few nodes that work together to fetch HTML content from a website, extract specific data and display it on the HTML page. The HTTP request node sends an HTTP GET request to the specified URL retrieving the HTML content from the website we want to scrap. Next, the HTML nodes come into the play. It's extract the desired data from the HTML content based on the specified HTML type which in our example is C type. After extracting the data, it goes through the template node. This node uses a handlebar template to generate an HTML page with extracted data. We customize the template to create a visually applying HTML page. Finally, the HTTP response node sends the generated HTML page as a response to the HTML request node made to the Node-RED. This means that when we access the Node-RED server through a web browser, we can see the scrapped data displayed on the HTML page. So here is the demo. Now. Let's see this flow in an action. We will deploy the flow and trigger it. Node-RED will send an HTTP request to the specified website, retrieve the HTML content and extract the data within P tags. Generally an HTML page using the template and display it in the browser. As you can see, the extracted data is now beautifully displayed on the HTML page. This page can be accessed from many, from any devices connected to the same network as your Node-RED server. You can even host this page on a web server to make it accessible from anywhere in the world. Web scrapping with Node-RED can be useful in various scenarios. For instance, you can scrap data from the news website, e-commerce platform or social media sites to gather information or analyze trends. You can also use it to the automated data collection for research purpose or to get or to create to create personalized dashboards with real-time data. That's it for the today's tutorial on web scrapping with Node-RED and displaying the data on the HTML page. We have explored the flow, explained each node's role and demonstrated how it works in action. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and that it inspires you to explore further with Node-RED. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it with others and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more exciting videos. Thanks for watching and happy coding.